Former United States Vice President Joe Biden has denied allegations of sexual misconduct raised against him, saying that he had not once acted inappropriately. The Democrat was responding to those allegations made by his party member Lucy Flores. Biden, who is speculated to run for the 2020 U.S. presidential election, has said that he could not recall the alleged incident. In an article, Flores said that Biden made her feel uncomfortable during a 2014 campaign event. Flores, uh, who was at the time of the alleged incident running for the post of the Lieutenant Governor of Nevada, accused Biden of kissing the back of her head and smelling her hair without her consent. Recalling the incident, she said, and I'm quoting, I couldn't move, I couldn't say anything, I wanted nothing more than to get away from him. The U.S. Vice President had just touched me in an intimate way and I felt powerless to do anything about it, is what she said. Joe Biden has defended himself, saying, and I'm quoting again, not once, never did I believe I acted inappropriately. It was never my intention. I may not recall these moments the same way, and I may be surprised at what I hear. After Flores' article was published, videos of Biden apparently behaving inappropriately with several women began surfacing. In a 2015 video, the then Vice President Joe Biden can be seen placing his hands on the shoulders of Stephanie Carter, the wife of the then Defense Minister Ashton Carter. In another event, in 2011, Biden can be seen holding Democrat leader Richard Baltimore's daughter Claire by her waist. Biden had been the U.S. Vice President for eight years under former President Barack Obama. All right. Thank you, sir.